In today's video, me and my brother Jonathan took on the challenge of making a brand new crystallized Lego mock in 24 hours. That's one day to get a full entire mock done, complete, and it has to look good. So right now it is 10 a.m. and we have till tomorrow morning at 10 a.m. to get this whole entire crystallized mock done. So at this time, only the first 12 episodes of Crystallized have come out. And honestly, my favorite episode is the one where the ninjas take over this board tower truck that's moving through Ninjago City to try to get Aspira's staff. So my brother Jonathan started working on the base of this truck. So I started working on the real selling point, the minifigures. The new ninja are an awesome new team of ninja. They're kind of super annoying and their weapons are sick. But how do you recreate them in Lego? This is a red 2x4 Lego brick. One of the most common Lego pieces in the world. And this is Kai's Legacy Mask. The second most popular Lego piece in the world. And dude, it's so cheap to get him. I literally bought 10 it Legacy Kai helmets for four bucks. So now I have way too many Kai Legacy helmets. This is where Posca pens come in handy. Posca pens are like really, really nice painting pen thingies. Look it up. They're cool. I need to paint two totally black for Lloyd and Jay, and then I need to paint five for the new ninja. I got my sister to help me paint them, and we got going. The painting process was very, very tedious, and I'm not really good with detail. Paint me yellow and call me a banana. What? We had to put a couple layers on different things and we were running out of time and this is the worst part Alrighty guys, so we have stuff going on this evening. So that means we only have an hour and 56 minutes no, one hour One hour one hour We have one hour before we have to leave and then all we have is tomorrow morning to build so I got going I got out all my minifigures and found yellow arms pink arms purple arms blue arms and then I tried to get darker themed body and legs for these minifigures put the arms on so so far in the show you haven't seen the ninjas faces so I had to just look at their eyes and try to find the right eyes and eyebrows that fit now that the Posca pens were dry I was able to put the helmets on and it looked so sick but now we had to leave my brother got the base of the truck done and he's starting to work on the box it's not nearly done yet and I've got some of the minifigures kind Kind of done. I still need to make their weapons. Oh. So yesterday we started at 10 o'clock a.m. and right now it's 7:17 a.m. So we've got to get back to work. We only have three hours to get this done, so we better get going. So me and my brother started working on the box of this truck. It's this huge hunking like truck thing. We had to put swinging doors on the back. We built, we built, and we built. And guess what? We got it done. There we have it, guys. A crystallized mock in less than 24 hours. Let's go check it out. So guys, here we have it. The crystallized truck chase getaway. I don't know what else to call it. The characters here are quite possibly the best part of this build. We have the fusion ninja. We've got the orange ninja, the teal ninja, the yellow ninja, the pink ninja. We've got Lloyd J. And we also have a Borg Tower security guard. The Fusion Ninja has this cool purple sword. Orange Ninja has two orange katanas. The Teal Ninja has this awesome transparent blue sword. And the Yellow Ninja has this double-edged thing. And then the Pink Ninja, of course, has this huge hammer to destroy the other ninja. Then we have this awesome Four tower tank truck thingy. So if you lift the top of this off, you can see a trident from Merlopia, Asphira's staff, and a shield that the ninjas use in Master of the Mountain. You've got two big doors back here that open up. This thing is really chunky and you can actually lift it off um, for purposes, I don't know. The truck part is really cool. My brother made it. So you've got an interior where you can actually fit two characters. It also has some awesome looking headlights and some cool exhaust. So in order to make this thing look more interesting and cool, we added highlights of sky blue, um, like lines across the side of it and then across the front of it. So guys, if you want to build this yourself and get the instructions for this, you can go to the link in the description or brick-legends.com to purchase the instructions for this and the new ninja. You can build all the custom ninjas in this awesome tank truck. And guess what? It's half off from now until this date right here. So without further ado, peace out. Subscribe.